When deciding to sell your home, orange walls may not be the best choice. More than likely, your home will sit on the market for quite some time. Today, I'm gonna go over paint colors that will help sell your home quickly and for more money. Hello everyone, I am Jen with Sold by Genji, brokered by EXP Realty, your Delaware Realtor. When I'm touring with buyers, I often tell them to look past the paint colors and look at the bones of the house. But more often than not, it doesn't really work. Distracting paint colors can often make it extremely difficult to use their imagination to help the buyer picture their own furniture and belongings in their home. Let's go over room by room on which paint colors will help you get the most for your house. Kitchens. Although white kitchens are all the rage right now, it's not going to last. Homeowners are starting to realize that white kitchens are a pain to clean. Instead, buyers are opting for blue-gray hues, whether it be on the walls or on the cabinets. Now remember, you also want to have contrast. Painting the walls a bluish gray, on average, the house is sold for $1,800 more. A color you will want to avoid in the kitchen is yellow. Yellow kitchens, on average, the house is sold for $820 less. Bathrooms. Now blue isn't just for the kitchen. Bathrooms that are painted a light blue create a relaxing experience. On average, homes with light blue bathrooms have sold for $5,500 more. A color to avoid in the bathroom? White. On average, white bathrooms sell for $4,000 less. Bedrooms. Bedrooms painted a range of cerulean have on average sold for more. Now, if you're asking me what cerulean is, it is a shade of blue and it's a range. So it could go from a sky blue all the way to a teal blue. A color to avoid in the bedrooms, pink. A pink bedroom on average, the home has sold for $208 less. Living rooms. Now, this is the one spot I'm going to tell you, do not paint blue. On average, blue living rooms have sold for $820 less. So what color should you use? Beiges and gray browns create a warm and inviting feeling. You should accent it with a white fireplace and white trim. On average, beige living rooms sell for $2,000 more. The dining room. The color of choice for the dining room is bluish gray. Starting to see a pattern? <laughs> Homes that have a bluish grayish dining room on average have sold for $2,000 more. The color to avoid in the dining room, red. Homes with red dining rooms on average have sold for $2,000 less. A little side note, red is the absolute worst choice to make for any room in your house. On average, homes with red walls have sold for way less than asking. Front door. On average, homes that have a navy front door have sold for $1,500 more. Last but not least, the exterior. Do not forget to show your exterior some love. Homes with a grayish beige tint to them, on average, sell for $3,500 more. So what's the moral of the story? Light gray, beige, and a range of blues are definitely the colors of choice. I hope this video helps. Make sure you follow me on all my social media. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you on the next one. <music> distracting paint colors can make it quite, mm, distracting paint colors can often make it extremely difficult picturing, distracting paint color, Remember, you, you as the, using these colors, painting the walls a bluish gray had on, <clears throat> yellow kitchens on average have sold for $820 less, not right. <laughs> Light blue brown, <laughs> 
Rồi, 